Hello, today I'm going to review a case. This is a case of a man in his 40s, patient with worsening headache, left side weakness, and seizure. He had a story of right cranial tomy for resection of a grade 2 astrocytoma and chemo radiation completed over five years ago. This is the his MRI image. The first image is axial T1 ridge image. In the middle is T2 ridge image. And the third one is fluid or we call flare image. So in this three, the, the well apparent to show the brain lesion was is clearly image in the clear image. So what we see is, is hyper intent with sickening gyring in the right hemisphere. It's a key finding brain MRI with and without contract. Post surgical chain of the pre right craniotomy for tumor resection, right cerebral hemisphere with chiro sickening and associated sec. Sacral advancement in prestige to player signal cortical lepto meningeal enhancement, no actual impacts. Relevant, relevant history there is a remote history of radiation therapy, epsilon to imaging people, finding clinical presentation of. Headache, neurological deficit, and seizure. So what is different so diagnosis of the case? First one is subacute cerebral infarction, smart syndrome, rhabdomeningeal metastasis, very pseudo progression. The final diagnosis is the clinical and imaging finding are suggestive of the smart syndrome which was the presumed diagnosis by the multidisciplinary team of note. The patient had the right frontal biopsy that revealed reactive diagnosis. This is a follow-up scan with the same case. Also, we see clearly in the clear image but heterogeneous apparent was seen in the T1 contrast study. So on the whole half of my day is missing. Persistent increase T2 player signal and gyro sickening with mass effect. And there is usually decrease in answer. So what is the the stroke like So what is a stroke like migraine attack after radiation therapy syndrome or because one syndrome? Stroke like migraine attack after radiation therapy or because one syndrome.
It's a rare delay complication of radiation therapy to the brain associated with migraine like headache, stroke like symptom. The exact pathophysiology of small symptoms remain unknown and the slightly multifactorial causes. Smart syndrome is a clinical and a radiological diagnosis. In the lit literature, those who underwent brain biopsy demonstrate mild and non specific cryosis. Smart syndrome is very rare, and the overall incident rate remains unclear. Smart syndrome can present in both adult and pediatric population. The mean age of onset is 45, and the remain time to symptom develop after adolescent therapy is around 14 years. Radiation of history may include all brains of coprolactic irradiation. In the literature, a dose of over 50 GY is often reported. Common represent include unilateral migraine type. Head which can be poor or generalized and stroke like neurogenesis. Like Symptoms and type of cell eating and resolve within 2.5 months, but some patients may experience incomplete recovery. The report insurance rate is 55 to 62 percent. Brain MRI is a primary imaging authority of the child. The key imaging feature unilateral T2 flare hyperintense cortical swelling in neural in neurovascular distribution and re reversible jelly-form cortical in lactose meaning gear enhancement. Enhancement may also over HD. Restrict GDPs may may not be present. When restricted to choose is present, it may suggest delay of complete recovery. Note that smart sim sim Syndrome is a diagnosis of exclusion. There must be no evidence of recurrent last exam or cerebral infection. Treatment due to the reality of smart syndrome, there is current no standard treatment guideline. Treatment is usually symptomatic, for example, anti-seizure medication, aspirin and verapamil may have reduced the severity of as well as recurrent. In patients with severe headache and neurological deficit, corticosteroids are used to reduce focus serotonin. However, steroid use in the acute phase may also be related to incomplete recovery. This is my reprint is from Admini.